Welcome in a universe community. This is Sanjata Pandey and our topic for today is How do you know someone is jealous of you? Do you need a bag full of red flags? No, even one red flag should be enough to know this person is for you or not for you. This person retired from his office and he was surprised to find that he had started losing all his golf games. What happened all of a sudden? Because the energy surrounding him was not real people. It was people who wanted something from him, who had their own personal goals. And once he retired, they were their real selves. So this is how life is. You should be surrounded by real people. Have a small group of friends, those who are real, those who stand by you, come what may. So here are 15 points to tell you if somebody is jealous of you. So the first way you can know somebody is jealous of you is you feel very uncomfortable in their energy. The questions they ask you or even the aftertaste of the conversation is such that you just don't feel good. That is how you know. Simple. Your inner being is constantly guiding you about the energy that comes to you or you are surrounded by that surrounds you all the time. Only if you have this awareness and mindfulness to realize it. Now the second way you know if somebody is jealous of you or not is that they show like they don't know. Even the small achievements or small things, daily things like you should know this, but they will show that they do not know. And it is just the opposite. They know more about you than what is required. They will be stalking all social media platforms you are in and they will be knowing more about you than you know about yourself. So that is how you know somebody is jealous of you. The third way to know somebody is jealous of you is they'll be constantly comparing themselves with you just for no reason. Now you will be wondering why do you compare at all? There's no need to compare. But in the conversations, in between the lines, if you read carefully, there will be instances where you find them comparing with you constantly. I am a content writer. Oh. I just became an editor. That way, you will just know. Also, they will be comparing you with other others who are doing better than you just to make you feel you are not enough. See, you are not doing well. So, you seem happy but actually don't be so happy. You still have to do a lot of things because there are so many people doing well in your own field. So that is how you know somebody is jealous of you. They will be misguiding you. They will be misguiding you and manipulating you for very very little things. Very small things. Something like I upload YouTube videos. Don't do that. I think this is a better, better platform and you know it on your face. No, this is a bigger and better platform and the one you are referring to is no good and so they'll be manipulating for little things they'll be trying to constantly intimidate you irritate you and then they say see you have changed from the time you achieved this or that you have changed this is not the way trying to blame you making you feel not so good about yourself making you feel question your behavior though you are not actually thinking about them or thinking about any such thing. So they will just constantly make you question your behavior just for nothing. Or they may be the people, person who is doing wrong but still they will make it feel like you are the person who is doing, doing them wrong. So that is how they will make you feel guilty for nothing. That is how also you know. See, energy will never lie. Energy never lies. So pay attention to the energy that surrounds you. The energy anybody brings in your space. Okay. So the next way to know how somebody, if somebody is jealous of you is 
they will always downplay your achievements oh this one came easy to you i think so there was no competition so they'll downplay your achievements oh you got this much somebody has got this one so that way so many ways to downplay your achievements or to show that they just don't know oh is it okay and not discussing anything further not giving you the importance you require so then also you should know somebody is jealous of you yet another way to know someone is jealous of you is that they will speak in behind your back though they are with you they speak they may speak good about you but in public they will show they don't know you they won't give you the importance or it is like they will not recognize your achievement in public it is always one to one on whatsapp oh you are wonderful but in public it is like hey don't you recognize me or you did not speak about my achievement when you could have spoken about it and i could have back that opportunity but no they don't want that opportunity to come to you so that is how also you know this person is not for you this person is actually jealous of you another way to know somebody is jealous of you is they will not respect your boundaries because they are gaining a lot from you not having any boundary so any time they will enter any topic of negative anything they are ready to discuss with you just to know your your stance on that topic however when you set boundaries look i am concentrating on, on something i am focusing on something they do not like it because basically they don't respect you for who you are they are just with you to know more about you and to gain something from here to go there and gossip about you or maybe because you are popular and you are a good source for of information for them so that they can take this information and go and sit with somebody else so that is how also you can know somebody is jealous of you they will never make an effort to make you realize your goals they speak good when they are around they will always be seen around you but when the time comes to make an effort to go out of the way not even something big little thing which will require little effort they are not ready to do because they know that this little effort is so important for you so that is how also you know this person is jealous of you and instead they will not put in effort and instead try to blame you and bring you into some kind of confusion to show that it is you the problem is you always the problem will always be you. and so that is how you know somebody is jealous of you another way to know somebody is jealous of you is they be friends with your detractors they know this person is not for you and still you are friends with them why so that is a good way of knowing somebody is jealous of you why do you go and stand with those who are against me so that is a big way a good way of knowing somebody is very jealous of you they will stop you from doing something which is good for you they'll stop you from doing your work with concentration maybe by spoiling your mood by irritating you blaming you intimidating you because they know they will intimidate you your mood gets spoiled and your whole day is ruined though you there is a lot to learn from here that you may become a master of your emotions and don't let them do so that is fine that is a good way of learning for you and continue doing what you were doing don't care what others think about you don't look for validation outside so that is something spirituality teaches us that is how you grow spiritually and as an individual but however from the point of view of a jealous person they have done everything to intimidate you and so that today gets wasted your today gets wasted thinking about them constantly why did this person tell me this say this to me or why are they angry with me 
what have I done? Please let me know how can I make you feel good. So there is so much to learn and spirituality is not something, you know, I think spirituality is something essential. It is essential knowledge to learn, to live your life well and in positivity and with good energy. So it is essential knowledge required for each and everybody regardless of their age. Another thing that tells you somebody is jealous of you is that when you start doing well, they stop talking to you. And it's like what happened all of a sudden? Why am I so alone? So they stop talking to you. And why there won't be any reason for them? It is like I'm just not talking to you. you that person you are. So that is how you know that you are actually growing and somebody is really jealous of you. Those who are jealous of you, they feel very bad when you start taking care of yourself, when you start loving yourself, when you start giving importance to your goals in life. That makes them feel very insecure and that is also a good sign that somebody is jealous of you and also that they will always make you feel like you are not enough their focus is always on you are not enough just to give an example this song is playing look at my performance and this person who visited our house, it is like busy talking about everything in the world than concentrating on the video. Even after cajoling him to look, 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 this is my achievement, this is something I sang recently and this is so good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what happened in your office and everything well and I think this person did not ring you. Can't you wait for three minutes? But why do you ask them to wait for three minutes? That is the thing. This is what you have to learn. Don't ask for validation from outside. All you have to do is believe in yourself. And it is very naive to ask for validation from outside. Look, look at me. Appreciate me. Look, I have done well. Be happy because you have done well. Be proud that you have done well. Your self-affirmations will be, must be, yes, you are good. You are going so well. You are doing well. Come on, keep it up. So who are you waiting for? Everything you need is well inside you. All the love you have been waiting for is inside you. That is, it is within you. So don't wait for anybody to appreciate you or to love you. You are already whole, you are already full of so much love. Just start loving yourself. Start reaffirming you are so good. You are thankful for who you are. In the now, in this now, in this present moment, let me just remind you, you are already enough. You are already whole. You don't have to become anything. That's it. Accept yourself as who you are and keep improving who's stopping you but never seek validation from outside. So this is it. When you are so full of appreciation for yourself, so full of love for yourself, then you can share this. When your own cup is full, when your own cup is full, you can share this love with others. That is how it is. Be full yourself first and then share it with others. Spread your light far and wide. Thank you so much Inner Universe community for joining me. I hope this video helps you to recognize the individuals you are surrounded with and to recognize the energy that surrounds you and to know what is the energy you have to block in your life because don't test yourself too much. Block negative energy or jealousy coming from somewhere and be with a small group which supports you which is for you. People who are there for you, people who love you for who you are and who are there to support you, who believe in you, who believe in your dreams and goals. Thank you so much. Bye. Namaste.